Mr. Rayford. It's always a pleasure. Why you just save your breath? I didn't come here to trade lies with you. You seem a tad upset. I'm mad as hell. What can I do to help you? You are mad at You're a liar. I should tell you I'm not. It's okay. You can let him go. Now, don't do anything we're both going to regret. Now, what seems to be the trouble? You gave me a word that you'd look for Anna. So? Well, you haven't done a damn thing about her, have you? That's not true. Well, I kept my end of the bargain. Your booze is in my storeroom. Now, where's my wife? I don't know. And you don't have any intention of finding out, do you? No, these things take time. Yeah, well, you just ran out of time. You're in no position to be giving me ultimatums. I don't give a damn what happens to me. But you listen to me. I should blow the whistle on you right now. And blow the best chance you have of finding your wife. That's real smart. You don't tend to do anything to help him, do you? Every available man I have is out there looking for her right now. And yet you still can't turn anything up. Even an organization as extensive as mine can produce miracles. You said you deliver her. And I will. This guy who kidnapped your wife isn't advertising the fact. Whoever he is, he came out of nowhere and he's gone straight back. And you're telling me that he can't be traced, is that it? I'm telling you, it won't happen overnight. But sooner or later, we're going to dig him up. Well, later, it might already be too late for Anna. All right, Duke, it could fall that way. That's the chance you'll have to take. We'll have to work. You're feeling helpless and out of touch now. Try sitting in prison. There's absolutely nothing you can do for Anna behind bars. Which is where you wind up if you so much as blink at our deal. I go to prison and I'm taking you with me. Yes, but you'll be doing time for murder. I can produce as many witnesses as I need to... You listen to me. I'll give you one week. Okay, you're home just one week. You find out where Anna is, or else I'm tipping all your booze in the harbor. <laughs> Hello, Dan. Hello, oh, Robert. I've been out uh, supervising the search for Anna. I'm glad you got my message. Well, it's just a matter of time. We've narrowed the area down east a few streets. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. Well, we should be able to locate her pretty soon, you know. Thanks, I think, in large part to you. Robert. You know, I can't tell you how much I appreciate the work that you and the people in the department have done in really pinpointing the area. You know, you've saved us an enormous amount of time. I only wish... You know, without you guys, I think we would have had to search the entire city. You may yet. What do you mean? I have some rotten news. Well, you haven't made a mistake, have you? No. Only in thinking we'd finish the job. Uh, I can't follow. I, I, I was talking to an old-timer down the Hall of Records. He'd heard about the search. Yeah, who has? Well, you remember this contractor moved around a lot. It seems that he didn't work on only low-income housing. How many other sections could be involved? We don't know. The records were destroyed in a warehouse fire in 1972. Nothing left? Not a trace. So the company could have built anywhere? Yes, we have no way of narrowing it down. Dang. I'm so sorry. back where we started. Wish there was something I could do. So do I. This means we're going to have to inspect every old house in Port Charles. I feel awful about getting your hopes so high. It's not your fault. You were so close. Now it will be like looking for a needle in a haystack. I mean, it could be literally bloody anywhere. Oh, 
I didn't need your sister in the last time. I really don't know. If I were clairvoyant, then uh, I'd say because I knew it probably wasn't going to happen. Well, I'm glad you remembered this time. Because I feel like I'm safe. I'm safe ground. Oh, you are. Everything's going to be perfect. I prescribed this for you. What is that? It's a sleeping pill. It's very important that you get as much rest as you can. I don't need any sleeping pills. Just try this. You want some water to take it with? 